Okay, I'm making this video because I felt like God wanted me to make this video and put it on the internet. And kind of the overarching theme here is I want to put God first in everything I do and kind of more specifically my business. And also maybe just kind of share about me a bit. Um, but before I talk about me, because uh, it's not all about me, I want to communicate that if you're watching this right now and you're going through anything, you're struggling with anything, there's anxiety or you have a burden that you're carrying and life is just weighing heavily on you, um, I want you to know that God loves you. There's a verse, it's really simple, you may have heard it, maybe not. First Peter 5, 7 says, cast all your anxieties on him because he cares for you. So this is just me saying that if you're going through something, uh, God is there for you. And if you feel like you're not, he's not, pray. Pray and, and talk to him. Um, and, and I believe that he will reveal himself in some way to you. And one of the biggest things that I would also uh, say that I've learned to, to do, and it's not easy at all, is to just open up about those things you're struggling with. You'd be really shocked how many people are right there with you in the same exact boat and have the same exact struggles. And we're not, we're humans, we're relational people. We're not meant to deal with things by ourselves. So if you're walking alone, like just have those conversations with people. You might be shocked how many people would be willing to, to walk alongside you uh, and uh, just to talk those things out. I am a verbal processor. Uh, so it helps me to talk to other people, hence why I'm sitting here giving a monologue on YouTube about stuff that I just felt like was on my heart. So kind of moving forward, uh, I'm, I'm going to give a little bit of history of, of, of me and kind of tell my story a bit. I'll start five years ago. Well, I'll start further back. Basically, I've been a, you know, I was raised in a Christian family, but it wasn't until high school that I really decided like, hey, uh, I can't do life without God. He is the one that sets my path straight. He is the one that uh, has a plan for me. And I tried to do things on my own and do it how I wanted to do it. And that got thrown in the trash quick. <clears throat> so anyway, fast forward five years ago, I basically saw this pattern of me trying to define who I was by myself. And I felt like there was these doors that were just slamming in my face, slamming in my face again and again until one day, Basically, there was a door that opened up and I decided to walk through that door and it was the door of video production, videography, uh, photography, all kind of camera stuff. Um, if there's one thing you should know about me, I'm not that great at anything except for the one thing that I am good at, which is making videos. So God always has operated through open and closed doors for me. And when I tell you that there was closed door after closed door after closed door, I believe uh, in, in God, I have a relationship with Jesus. And um, for me, it wasn't so much like I'm angry at God as much as it was I'm angry at myself because I realized I was trying to carve my own path and God was just saying, door slam, door slam, door slam. In other words, nope, that's not for you. Nope, that's not for you. In hindsight, I'm glad those doors were shut because yeah, God was right. It, they weren't for me. Fast forward, basically my career takes a path that uh, leads me into creating video content for businesses, for content creators, YouTubers, uh, probably some that uh, you know very well uh, and others maybe a bit more obscure. Either way, met a lot of really great people. And this video is not your typical, I worked with so-and-so and this is the reality and this sucks. I love everybody that I've worked with. I care for everybody that I've worked with. And that is something that I have very uh, intentionally maintained in my business and in my conduct with people is I do care for them. And I wanna do my best work. I wanna be very intentional with my work and put my best foot forward and uh, you know over deliver. And it's, it's tough because you, you, you get to love people, you get to know people, you get connected with people, and then you reach stages in your life like right now where I am um, growing an agency that is creating content for businesses. Um, and 
you have to move away from a more like personalized one-on-one experience with somebody where you're just in the, the trenches day in and day out creating content for them to taking a step away, a step back, building a system, working in the shadows to create something that's scalable and that works for businesses and individuals that are growing businesses and it kind of sucks. Um, and it's been, it's been a bit of a struggle for me um, because I care so much about people that I never want to not do the most that I can possibly do for somebody. But it's almost this, this like paradox of like, you're wanting to do more, so you have to do like less. You have to like, you know, pull back a bit. Um, I don't even really know why I'm sharing this um, other than to say I'm growing a business and I want to put God first in that. And I have not been as open as I should be about my relationship with Christ online. And so this is it. And the truth is, uh, some of the closed doors recently have come in the form of like distance from relationships that I used to be a lot more close with. And also growing a business, I'm kind of like, I feel like I'm just running straight into like a black abyss of the unknown because I have no idea what I'm doing. I'm learning for as, from as many people, from as many mentors and friends that have uh, once been where I am now to kind of lead me through this entrepreneurship journey. So never watch my content and think that I have it all figured out. To be honest with you, I don't. There are things though that I learn every day uh, that do fascinate me that I feel really led to share online. Some of it's entrepreneurial, some of it's just mindset, some of it's about content creation, but yeah. Um, but that's what this channel is ultimately gonna be about and I'm gonna begin sharing more on this channel and really just being kind of raw with it. But to come full circle, I wanna provide value for you guys and I wanna provide a mindset for you guys that cares about people heavily, but also focuses on the God-given gifts that I have. And like I said, I'm not that good at many things, but I'm good at one thing, and that's videos. So I'm going to, I'm, I, I'm doing my best to share that skill set with businesses to help them grow, um, which I have successfully done for a lot of people. Um, but now it is going to be something that's offered to the masses, not just a individual one-on-one -on -one basis. Um, I'm trying to multiply myself online. Um, so this is kind of me putting myself out there and saying that the place that I am in today and the experiences that I have and the relationships that I have and the, the, the love that I have for the, the people that I've interacted with and worked with and um, the experiences that I've been blessed to have is all from God. Remember when I talked about those closed doors? Those all, this happen every day. <laughs> they happen every single day. Uh, trust me, like all, I'd love to have all this glory and like have a Porsche 911, uh, but <laughs> the reality is none of it matters. Ultimately, none of it matters. I am just humbly sharing this on the internet. This might not reach anybody, um, but that's who I am. So if you wanna know anything about my business, uh, the, the link to my business is in the um, like description of this channel. I'll also link it below. Um, Bitsmith Agency, that's what it's called. And um, we create, ad, we do ad creative, we do content creation for brands. It's never, it's it like the, today is the day of making video content online and it's never been a better time to get into it. This is not a sales plug. Uh, this is just ultimately me sharing about what I'm doing and kind of where this, this, what this channel is gonna be more about. Yeah, I, I want to represent integrity. I want to represent just dedicated and like care through my work. That is That desire is not one for me to gain a bunch of worldly glory. It's one that literally has been a continuation of open doors from God and I've walked through them, so here I am. So to wrap up this video um, in, in a, like a, a sandwich of encouragement, if, again, if you guys found yourself on this channel and you're looking for a good mindset and you're looking for uh, just some like raw honesty, um, let me know, like share in the comments. Um, if you've made it this far in the video, like you're probably in the right place because like I don't want to give a bunch of fluff or pretend that I 
am somebody that knows everything or I have like the key to success in life. I don't. But what I do have the key to is uh, purpose and fulfillment. And that is uh, through a relationship with the Lord, not through work. Um, and that's just it, plain, plain and simple. And I know that that is the key to you ridding yourself of your anxieties and uh, finding relationships that are encouraging and that are helpful and that like just give you, breathe new life into you. And so that's what I want for you um, ultimately. And uh, yeah, this is like a giant, like just monologue. I don't even know if any of this made sense, but if it did, great, great. We're very similar people. You will be seeing short form content on this channel and you will be seeing long form content on this channel. Uh, I just got to figure out what the heck I'm going to say because I don't, I'm not feeling very inspired, but I made this video because I felt like the Lord was telling me you need to make this video and then he will inspire me from there. So we'll see. It is 1 a.m. Going to go to bed. But uh, if you watch this whole video, you're a real one. Feel free to subscribe uh, and we'll keep this show rolling. So I appreciate you guys. God bless. And uh, yeah, we'll see you in the next video.